Hello, friend. How do you like our journey today on this huge Titanic? It's incredibly huge. There are a lot of people here. Well, let's go with you and take a short excursion for our viewer. Yes, you are really right to find an empty, deserted place here. It was simply unreal. Let's go for a little walk around the ship, show the kitchen to our viewers. Just be quiet and don't scare away all the cooks. Otherwise, they will run away so as not to get caught on camera. Well, guys, here we have the kitchen itself. Here the chef prepares the food. Yes, this is, of course, very interesting looking. Here, by the way, the chief left us one room, or rather a cabin, with two beds. We can stay there with you and show you the view from the window. It's just an incredible view. Moreover, this ship is famous for its armor resistance. It is the largest ship in the world. It simply cannot be broken by absolutely anything. Yes, it's very cool that you and I are sailing on such a cool ship today. Yes, of course! Oh, God! Oh, oh my God! <laughs> Guys, what happened to me on my son? He threw me somewhere on the shore, somewhere very, very far away, even into the forest. Yes, I'm conscious. Everything is fine. But it seems I can't move my arms and legs. I urgently need to sit down some kind of golden apple to gain strength and come to my senses. Good. I will definitely help you. Of course, how can I leave my friend in trouble? So guys, look, we have some kind of huge canyon here, and it seems to me that somewhere over there, there might be some abandoned house, where you can find at least some supplies. Let's do this. I have some kind of chest here. In it, there are several sticks, unfortunately with apples. Oh, thank you very much. At least usually apples are on. I may recover a little, but golden ones would definitely not bother me. I understand you. We're already working in this direction to get military gold apples. And since that's what we're doing, let's break this birch tree. After that, we'll move this whole workbench and make a stone one. And so great! We already have a little bit of wood. Now we will create a workbench. So guys, everything is ready. I have already created an axe. I have already chopped down the trees. I have already translated everything. I didn't want to hold your attention. Now we will move over there to that edge of this cave. Let's make a small bridge like this. Not very neat. But what did it want resources for? And now it's time to go in that direction. At least I have three arrows. I can at least somehow defend myself. So there are some undead that I can meet here. So let's carefully go deep into the forest. Oh God, guys, I think I see someone's legs there. Oh no, there's only one zombie. The zombie is already coming at me. Yeah, I got an arrow right in the face. It was incredible, guys. I'm too good at shooting. Well, here's a second zombie coming at me. Oh God, it fell out of him, some kind of super gun. Damn, what a pity that there are no cartridges for it. Because there are only 10 cartridges in the chamber, you won't have enough for everyone else. Well, what about the last zombie? Oh no, he hit a pig. Let's get into hand-to-hand -hand combat and finish him off. Get it, zombie. It's just incredible, guys. How cool is this? Oh my god, there are still a bunch of all sorts of infected pigs. And it seems I see some kind of house in which there may be supplies that we will need to help my friend. Well, guys, I already climbed up a tree. There was a ladder. And now let's shoot at these zombies. They are unrealistically strange and should get what they deserve. Oh, God, how they fly away merrily. It's just a super cool and very powerful gun, guys. I'm incredibly happy that I have such a gun, got it? Now let's jump onto the next tree and continue. Let's hit these zombies. And it seems that all the zombies are gone. It was very fast. This gun is super strong. It kills absolutely all the zombies with one shot. But what about the guys? And I'm very glad now let's go inside this house. So it remains still. Finish off a couple of zombies that appeared. It seems these are zombies. The employees of this house are great. Well, now we have a map that we found in one of the chests. Oh, great, guys. Just look here. There are also golden apples that my friend needs. I also got a diamond sword here. And this is very cool because I can now defend myself from other unknown zombies. They ran quickly to, hey, Mikey, I have golden apples for you. I got them. Wow, this is very cool. Thank you very much. Well, there were a couple of zombies from which it killed some abnormal pigmen who were defending the house in which I got flying golden apples. Hooray, I'm so glad that now I can walk. Normally, I'm very happy. Thank 
thank you very much again. Yes, perhaps it would be a good idea to get into that house and pick up the boats and sail away from here as quickly as possible because I can't be here any- I will stand and watch so that no one enters the house. Okay, well guys, let's look for boats in this building. Perhaps they are here. I didn't find anything in the first chest, but in the second chest, there are three boats at once. Well, we only need two. Let's eat two boats. Hooray, I'm so glad that we will soon sail away from here with you. I'm very happy. Thank you very much. Hello, everyone. Today, we will fly into space with my friend. Now, I will go to his house and knock so that he can quickly get ready and fly with me into space. Hey, hello. Hello. Yes, I've almost packed my things. You and I can get ready and go. Let's hurry up. Otherwise, the rocket is waiting for us, and space is already waiting for us, too. Yes, I agree with you. Space and the stars have already been a problem for us a long time ago. There are our rockets waiting for us. They ran quickly there. They are standing in the field. Wow, they are so cool, big. My green one, as I understand it, everything is correct. Should yours be red? Yes, your green rocket understood everything correctly because you are always green like a turtle. And I am red. I always wear red clothes. That's why my rocket is red. But why? Let's land and let's fly quickly. So guys, the rocket is already starting to accelerate. Just look how huge it is. How much smoke is flying from it. I'm very scared. But I hope everything will go well and smoothly. But the flight has already begun in this. Guys. Wow, incredible. We really ended up in space with you. It's so good that you and I took our mother's spacesuits here and didn't really get there. Just look what an incredibly beautiful planet this is. It's deserted here. Well, I like this because I want to transfer it to that planet. I will build a base there, and you build it here, so you and I will separate a little. I hope you don't mind. Well, okay, of course it's doubtful to separate in difficult space, but I think it won't be a big deal. So guys, we're left alone with you. Let's build a super cool space base here. I have a weapon with me. God, my guys. My instincts really didn't let me down. There are some incredible aliens here. I took a plasma gun with me and also took a lot of cartridges for it. Well, let's shoot at them. This is a green liquid from the plasma that eats them right through. It looks simply incredible. Super cool, guys. I think we would have it on Earth. We couldn't do that, but these aliens just fly into pieces. Just look at how powerfully my plasma gun blows them apart. It looks super beautiful. You definitely have to like it. Well, what's the last bunch of aliens left here in this base? And look, there is some kind of chest. We can determine with you what is there. We urgently need to see what is in this chest. Perhaps supplies are needed there for us. So let's see what's in this chest. I'm extremely interested in finding out what's inside. Oh, here's everything to build our super cool base. Let's quickly go upstairs and build it. <laughs> so the basic plan is to build a museum variable in the middle. <laughs> so let's start by first putting the main four boards and then around them, we will draw the outline of our super cool base house about which we will live on this planet. So I've almost finished building our super cool base. All I have left is to install glass so that no one really goes in there. And I also installed super cool reliable doors that open with a button, or rather, with the press of a thumb. Well, let's put another chest. We'll stuff glass in there. And also, let's put on a music plate. Well, let's throw off all the unnecessary stuff. And now we can call my friend to look at it all. Hello? Wow, what a cool base you have. I'm flying to you to look at it. It just looks incredible. How cool when you were able to do it. It just looks so incredible. You can't imagine how much effort I shared. There was an alien jacket. It's not a real huge cave. I destroyed them with the help of my plasma gun. What other cave? If there is a cave, then there are resources there. Let's go urgently and take a look. Didn't you know that? Oh wait, these are my resources. Don't touch them. You went to another planet on purpose. So look for resources there yourself. How greedy is this? I'm no longer friends with you. Wait, where are you going? Okay, guys, it seems he was offended by me because I didn't share these diamonds with him. Well, then I'll get more. Let's get all the diamonds that are in this cave. Well, guys, we have mined almost a whole stack of diamonds. Let's urgently put it at my base and go back to the cave because there are also very interesting resources that are usually not on our planet, but only on this one. Let's quickly go back to the cave. 
Maybe guys too, I got a super rare resource called Palladium. We will need to digest it and see what can be made from it. It looks very cool, but something, let's put it back where the diamonds went. Why don't I have any diamonds here? There are some, then poop. What is this, Lord? What a nightmare. Ugh, I already know it stinks. I think I know who did it. Let's fly and take revenge on him for this. I landed on the planet. Now I'll go and insert it, don't spoil it, and you give it back. Otherwise, I'll cleanse your head. Oh, okay, don't hit me, please. It hurts me too much. Okay, okay, I'm sorry that I stole your diamond. I won't do that again. I just don't have anything special here on this planet. I didn't know where he couldn't get resources. Friend, why are you bringing me here? Do you want to show me something interesting today? Yes, Mikey. Come quickly to my new house. Can you imagine today I moved? Just look at this view from the window. It's just crazy beauty. Yes, of course, it's all very beautiful. Okay, I have very urgent things to do today. I'll go do them while you put things away here. It's good for you to take care of business today. I'll be waiting for you guys. How do you like my new house? Well, so guys, I have something interesting for you. Do you think why I left my friend so early? Although taking into account the fact that he moved to a new house, I could stay with him today overnight to see how he would sleep there. But I, there are more important things to do. Today, we will play it by calling various evil mobs. Now, I will show you their eggs. These eggs were called to lie in my closet a long time ago because no one ever looks here. This is the ideal place to hide. And today we will prank him with those eggs. Well, the first thing we need to do is dig a hole so that when he falls into it, there will be zombies waiting for him. It will be just an incredible test for him. It will be very funny and so friends. So you and I have already dug in principle a more or less normal hole. Now, let's get the items that I need to close it and attract the attention of my friend for it. But before that, we need to immediately place several zombies that will attack him when he falls there and also cover this whole invisible thing in which you can very easily fall through. But what? Well, we have placed diamonds for you and me. Let's knock on his door to attract his attention so that he can see all this and quickly run into this hole and their very angry zombies will be waiting for him. It will be super fun. Guys, watch it. Oh my God, guys. I heard someone knocking on me. It's very strange. It doesn't seem like someone will be knocking on my door at one war in the morning. Let's see what's there. Wow, some interesting diamonds are lying on the path. Come on, let's check what's there. I can't see anything from the chest. Guys, just look. He came out of his new house. It will be a lot of fun, Lord. He fell straight into a hole. We will need to urgently help him and brush his teeth. Guys, this is very interesting. What kind of diamonds are these? Where are they from? Oh God, I fell into a zombie pit. God, I'm so scared. Buddy who bit you so hard, did the bees eat you? You were in the apiary. Why are you covered in blisters? What happened to you? Can you imagine someone dug a hole and dumped something on zombie? I fell into it and they bit me. It was very painful and unpleasant. Yes, this is certainly terrible, but why then you stay here? Diamonds have grown, I'll be back soon. Wait for me, I'll come back to you guys very soon. Well, our first plan worked, zombie. Now let's place the creeper here so that when he comes out of this cave, they will attack. This will be super fun. Oh yes, guys. Well, I brought as many as nine diamonds, my friend for some reason never came back. I don't understand where he is. Let's check. Maybe he's there waiting for me somewhere on the street. Oh God, there are two creepers standing there. What should I do? Lord guys, I have a bow and interesting super strong arrows that will throw these creepers back so that they don't explode next to me because creepers tend to explode when they are very stressed or angry about something. I hope I can fight them off. Oh God, there's a whole bunch of them there street. Look, they are highlighted in white. We can observe the white movements. Well, let's go out and finish them off. Which side is it a coincidence why he was my friend left the cave and they appeared here? This is not good. We need to go to the village and ask him, especially he's still not here. He is at home, but what? Let's go to his apartment and ask what it was, why he left me, and after that, creepers appeared everywhere. How do I know why creepers appeared there? I returned home because I really wanted to go to the toilet and don't shoot me with a bow. So, so it seems that I understand everything. I have connected the puzzle in your head here and I'm calling on you to set me up. And it's because of you that a bunch of zombies attacked me. 
forgive me, please. I won't do this again. It wasn't funny, really. No, I'll get my revenge on you again. I'll change the word. It'll be very strong. Guys, this is just incredible. How could he set me up? Why did he do this several times? He's already set me up and pranked me. We wait at night. So guys, it's already deep night. Now we'll go to his house because of the visors that are spawning there. I'll tell him straight away so that he doesn't notice anything. And what about me, guys? I'm already on his roof. And now we'll break it while he's sleeping so that he doesn't care about anything. Noticed and throws the visors there. It will be simply incredible, guys. It will be very funny. What is that rustling sound? Oh my god, guys. It seems he spawned a bunch of blades right in my house. It's just incredible. They're so evil. And that's what I'll do to anyone who makes trouble on purpose. Even friends like Mikey. <laughs> How cool it is that you and I are already done with things to do. You can finally go to bed. But today I'm tired of working on this beds calmly at night. Thank you for helping me. Yes, thank you very much. Soon our harvest will grow and we will be able to eat normally and not constantly go on forays. Well, good night to you, yo guys. Hello to you, Mikey. Today, I will have an interesting challenge for my friend. You have no idea what I came up with. It's simple, this is crazy. No one has ever done this before. I'll tell you what we'll do. I ordered a lot of dolls that look like me and also called three of my friends, Jimmy, Keith, and Jason. They look a little like me. And the task of my friend JJ will be to help him find me. I wonder if he's with this challenge. Watch the video to the end so you don't miss anything. It will be a very interesting challenge. Let's go, guys. Just look how they all look like me. Oh, guys, it's finally morning. Now we can come to my friend Mikey and see what we're going to do today. Let's knock on his house. And I, why doesn't he open the door? Hey, he opens the door. Where are you, Lord? Why isn't he at home? It's very strange. It doesn't look like him today. It's very early, but he's not here, guys. We need to find him urgently. Did something happen again? Maybe it was stolen by a witch or some zombie monster like Jelly. Hurry up and look for him, guys. Oh, God. What is this? What a nightmare. How much is my friend's worth there? Oh, God. What's going on here? Hey, who are you all? Why are they all standing and silent? Should I choose one or what? Guys, I think this is a challenge. I have to find a real t-shirt, but what, guys? Hello, it's me that didn't recognize me. I'll prove to you that it's me who's pushing. Trust me, I can do it. You'll regret thinking that I'm not real. Come on, tell me about your house. Take me on a tour. Let's see if you're real or not. Yes, it's as simple as shelling pears. Well, in general, look like this. I have a beautiful house, an interesting one. Here's a stone slab to climb onto it. This is not your house, have you forgotten? Villager John lives here. Come on, I'm kidding. Of course, this is not my house. How would you say that's it? Yes, yes, Jonah. And now let's go. I'll show you my real house. Now you'll just be surprised and you'll be incredibly shocked. Everything here is so cool. Everything is green. Wow, there's a bottle here. So everything in general. I understand you are not real. You will be a figurehead. No trash eyes. Next time, I will avoid you. You really offended me. Don't call me here again. Find a challenge. I didn't like playing with you at all. How disgusting you are. Yeah, guys. We need to find another Mikey urgently. So come on out. You're over there in the second row. Come on out here. Why, you didn't recognize me. It's me. I'm an excellent archer, and I know how to hit all sorts of interesting targets and goals. And so that you go hunting if you don't remember me at all. You say we went hunting with you and you know how to shoot well? But let's go and show me. Look, stand behind the red line and repeat after me. I shoot first, I'll hit three targets, and then I have to hit. Do you agree? Yes, of course I agree. Let's try. I've already done this many times. I'll stand and wait for you to control. So, beware. I aim at the first target. I shoot and halfway to the center. Now the second target is also passed. Well, the third target finally hit them. And now you have to repeat everything that you did. Well, okay, now I'll try. Come here, look now, I'll shoot with a bow. Wait for me. Well, I finished and it seemed like I was shooting normally as best as I could. Well, it's like I hit this one for sure. What can you say? It seems like it turned out okay. Well, of course it could have been better, but it seems to be good too. What did you do? You're definitely not real, Mikey. Mikey is so bad. Doesn't shoot. My friend always shot well and hit. Leave here and never appear in this village again. 
Well, now I have one more contender left. Come on, you're narrow-eyed. Hey, I'm a karateka. Have you forgotten? I've been doing karate for about 10 years. Now I'll show you all my skills and tricks. You'll still dance with me, and then you'll ask for forgiveness when you realize that I'm really real. Now, I'll show you everything. You say you can break everything in your way. Come on, let's go and show me your skills in practice. Well, break this tree and chop a couple of firewood for me so that I can light the stove today. Otherwise, it will be a cold night. I think you can do it. Ah, uh, yes, of course I can. Look, one, two, and now I'll just break this tree. It gets a tree. You'll still dance with me. Uh, listen, but it doesn't break. Somehow, I didn't manage to do it very well. A very strange tree. Did you really set everything up? I didn't imagine anything. You're just not real, and even decorative stuff is never about that. Of course, and you also don't look like my real friend. You're wearing your real clothes backwards. <sighs> you only know how to sneeze. But it's true. You're real. God, how have I not seen you before? Yes, well done, JJ. You today, well done. You coped with my task. Well, Mikey, we think you and I have done a great job, and now it's time to come and rest, because it's already night. You and I got all the resources that I wanted today. I need to be right. I'm already a little tired. Let's go home to sleep quickly. It's time for this. What a beautiful night it is today, guys. Just look at this beautiful nuclear sunset here. Oh, how tired I am of this fountain. I wish I could get it out of here as soon as possible. It's standing there. Wow, well, thank you very much for coming with me soon. Sweet dreams to you. Yes. And thank you very much. I also went with me to the extraction and got some leather with me. Well, guys, let's go to bed soon. Come to my house, I'll show you today. And the most important thing that I will show you is that I have an excellent bed on which I will now sleep great. Well, what is this for you? <laughs> guys, what happened? I heard some kind of incomprehensible scream outside the window. They are very scared that this happened. Lord, guys, some strange thing happened once we opened the doors. It's already morning, but I don't have doors. This is very strange. Guys, where are the doors in our barn? Where is it? Disappeared? What's happening in our village? Can you imagine? Someone stole our doors to all our villages. And in any case, there is definitely no door in my house. You also have a door missing somewhere. Let's quickly go search and see what's happening throughout our village. Good searches. I will also help you now and look for where the doors are. I never liked these holes, by the way. It's so good that someone stole them, but we still need to find who did it, or at least find the doors to put back. Wow, guys. It seems in the field I see now there are one, two, and not as many as four doors. Wow, this is very cool and interesting. Let's go see what kind of doors these are. Maybe we can take them with us. Hmm. Oh no, guys, I think I'm trapped. What's going on? Why can't I move? Lord, guys, help me. Someone please support me with a like so I can get out of here. I urgently need to call my friend Mikey for help. I think somewhere I hear my friend, it seems he got help. And guys, you also see how terrible it is. He fell into a trap of four doors. This is the most primitive trap. How could he fall for this? Let's run as soon as possible. Let's help him get out. Thank you very much for helping me get out of here. Don't worry, it doesn't happen to anyone. I also once fell for such simple traps. Just don't do it again, please. Otherwise, I won't be able to help you a second time. Well, yes, I am very attracted to this door. You also think that you need to go through it. And thank you very much. I haven't lived in the hands of such a cool sword for a long time. I'll be very interested to see what's inside. Well, guys, let's go through this vertical horizontal door. Let's check what's inside. My God. Guys, these are some scary cacti, Mexican monsters. What, oh no, it seems he attacked me, guys. We urgently need to fight them off. How well do you understand that he gave me this super cool, incredible sword? But it's just incredible, guys. I was able to fight them all off. Now we can take a few golden apples and go back. But now I need to understand how to climb back and please throw me a ladder. I can't get up from here. Help me, Mikey. Now I'll throw down the ladder for you. Don't shout too much. Don't draw unnecessary attention to us. Thank you very much for throwing it on the flight. I really thought I wouldn't get out of here. By the way, I took a golden apple with me. Look how cool it is. Yes, it's really cool. The golden apple was taken over. I wouldn't have taken two.
Well, guys, to be honest, I'm so tired of giving birth all day today. Looking for these doors. You can do it without them as no one really comes to the village for us. Okay? This is of course a joke, and you also see this iron door, damn it. What a pity that I can't open it. Open the football with some, some kind of lever that can open and allow me to go down there. Maybe there is something interesting there. Let's look for the lever, guys. Probably if there is a door, then there is it somewhere, not far here. You guys, indeed, it was true. I found a lever. It's so incredible, and someone, let's now be able to go down and see what's there. The guys ran. <laughs> oh, what a long staircase here and the way down. The most important thing is that he didn't attack her here. God, what's going on here is some kind of nightmare. There are so many doors, but they probably all disappeared right here. But who took them here? This is very strange, guys. Hey, hello. I got you. I moved all these doors here. Don't worry. We'll put them back now. Mikey. Why did you do this? This is extra work for us. Oh yes, guys, how cool. Today I decided to go on an outing and chop some firewood because our supplies in the village have completely run out. I'll need to save up a little wood. To be honest, I'm already a little tired. Oh guys, there's some interesting chest here. Hmm, I haven't noticed this before in our forest. We need to see what's there. Wow, interesting. This is some kind of device that opens portals to another world. Interesting, guys. I think I have an idea. My idea is that today we will troll JJ. Now I see him. He just found him at home. This thing can still perfectly zoom in on the entire image that we can see on the screen. Let's wait until he leaves his house and then open the portal so that he can enter. Well, guys, hello, everyone. Today I woke up too late. It seems my friend has already chopped wood. He should have told you about this because today we are filming a new video. Well, let's see what he did there. What is this so interesting? It seems like something interesting has opened here. Let's go into the portal and check what's there. Oh no, my head hurts too much after such a trip. What's here? Wow, some interesting cave appeared, so guys. <laughs> my new sword, which I chopped today, will really come in handy because I don't understand what's here. Maybe there's something dangerous here, zombies. My god, there's a whole crowd of zombies here, guys. We need to attack them urgently so they don't attack me first. Let's go, guys. No, 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 no. <sighs> Great, we're almost done with these zombies. Now we need to figure out how to get out of here. This wall somehow really attracts me. It seems like if there is something, let's find a chest with some kind of pickaxe to break it. So it seems I found a chest. Here there should be some kind of pickaxe. Yes, I was right. Let's now open this portal and go into it. Leave the blocks here, also leave the sword and the pickaxe, and go back to our world. We didn't really like it here, to be honest. Wow! Well, how do you like the first portal that I opened for him? Let's open the next one, guys! Let's see where he'll be thrown this time! Otherwise... Oh, I'm so tired of being in this cave. Where is my friend? Why can't he help me? Wow, here again! Some kind of portal has opened. I'll think about whether I should get into it, guys, or not. Because I didn't really like the first portal, there were a lot of zombies there. Well, let's try anyway. After all, we live once, and we need to try... Lord, my head hurts again after such a journey. Oh god, here, thank you. You are a portal with some witches. This is just terrible. They can throw me off. If I get too close to them, it's good that this time I have an interesting rainbow bow with arrows and we... Let's shoot at these witches so that they fall into the lava and don't interfere with me passing these tests. Well, guys... Wow, guys, I'm already tired of whining. We're in the middle of the procure. Well, let's continue doing this, haha. -ha. They're flying down so much fun. It's really, really cool how hard it throws back. If I had a regular bow, I don't know if I could do the same thing. Oh, guys, well. Well, are we now throwing off the last witches and let's go upstairs? Well, what's here? The second test has already been planted. He had to come back. But what about guys? Let's now open the next portal next to his house, right opposite the beds, so that he definitely notices it and immediately enters it. The guys run and hide. Oh, how tired I am today of these portals. Why are they opening next to me? Who is opening them? Oh god, another portal. Yes, as many as possible. 
Well, guys, let's do this. We'll be the last one. We'll check it for sure. And we'll never go into these portals again. Let's go, guys. So, what kind of test is this? Oh my god, some kind of lava box with some kind of obsidian doors appeared. That's where the next portal is 100% to return back to our world. So guys, I think we need to get some resources to cut it down. First, we will need cut down the tree after that. We will need to get stone to create first a wooden and then a stone pickaxe. And then we will need to somehow break this obsidian. We will definitely be breaking it for about 10 minutes, so I hope there is somewhere here for me. Diamond pickaxe. Great guys, here's a wooden Kira. How it's brightened up for us now. We will need to get a little more stone so that we can have a stone pickaxe. Let's guys do it quickly. <laughs> Great guys, here is the stone pickaxe. Now we just have to cut down this obsidian block, but it takes too long to be mined. There should 100% be a diamond pickaxe here somewhere. This is very strange, guys. Let's look for it. <laughs> Great, guys. I think I found a chest with a diamond pickaxe. Yes, guys, I was right. Now let's cut it down. Oh, yes. Now I see the portal. Great, guys. This is just incredible. I didn't even expect that I would be so smart. Now let's run back to our world. Oh, God, how my head hurts so much. Hey, and why were you the one who opened the construction of the portal? Well, come here. You won't catch me. JJ, you ran when you see me call me. It was very funny I trolled you. Guys, today, I'm planning to go with my friend Mikey on an incredibly cool adventure. For this, I need a diamond pickaxe, which I just recently created with my friend. We will mine diamonds with him. We agreed with him yesterday about our meeting. Now I'll go to visit him and show him. My new home, his apartment is really very nicely furnished. Wow, that the guys started singing unexpectedly for him. Hey JJ, why are you scaring me? That's no way to come in without knocking. I knocked on your door and you didn't hear me because I was loud and sang beautifully. Thank you for the compliment. That's very nice. So, what brings you to my house at this early hour? Tell me. Well, somehow I forgot something. Nobody. I'm not going anywhere with you today. I'm very busy. I have other things to do. So go without me, or don't go there at all. Let's reschedule this walk with excavations for another time. Guys, this is very strange and not like him. He usually never postpones such events to other days. We will need to keep an eye on him. This is very strange behavior for him. I am very unlike him. I, by the way, have a great idea. Let's go to my house now. I, I'll show you something. Now let's go down to my bunker and I'll show you an interesting potion that I recently invented. You will be very surprised. <laughs> this potion is located here in the chests. Now we will open it, and I will show you that by simply drinking this potion, I will disappear from sight. Only a glass of this potion will be visible. It will look incredible. We will be able to scare him and check what he will actually do today day. <laughs> well guys, he's wet at home. Let's quietly go in and check what he's doing. <laughs> it's so good that I was able to distract him. Now I can calmly go about my business. I'll now take a pickaxe and personally go dig up this diamond meteorite so that he gets fewer diamonds. This will be incredible. We need to hurry up. How can he do this to me? It's just terrible. It's not friendly to go and dig for diamonds without me. Ha <laughs> ha, you're probably sitting at home right now and don't even imagine that I'm running near your windows. It's simply incredible. Well, we need to run quickly so that no one spots us. Wow, there are so many diamonds here. It's just incredible. I'll dig up half of it so no one will notice that something is missing here. God, how dare he do this, but I will take revenge on him for this. Oh yes, my favorite ointment. There are so many of you here. I'll gather you all now. I need all the diamonds to be mine. I love them so much, but now I need to run further on business. Guys, I have a great idea. Let's put a diamond block right in front of him. He will be scared because the diamond block will appear out of nowhere. Oh God, how did he appear here? What's going on? Why is someone beating me? Are these some invisible wasps that started biting me? How did they get me? I wanna run away from here. Ah! 
It was very funny, guys. Like, you started this before? He stands and looks straight at my house. Can he really do something with it? And so on until he noticed me. I'm digging a hole here. My new house is next to his house so that he doesn't spot us. Now I'll sh Oh my god, guys, how dare he build such a huge bunker right next to my house. It's just incredible. Just look at how everything looks here. God, where did he get all this from? Oh yes, I have everything here. Diamond floor, diamond staircase, diamond armor, hand wash basin, tons of food, and a huge plasma TV. This is everything I dreamed of. Guys, she really still has one. Look at this huge blue sofa and huge TV. I dreamed about it all my life, but he bought it and didn't even tell me about it. <coughs> now I don't consider him my friend. We need to take revenge on him. Let's scare him like he has a ghost here. Ha ha ha. Hey, why is this drawer open here? I always close drawers after I use them. This is very strange. Not like me. I need to pay close attention. I feel like someone is watching me. I feel... Hmm... But this was the only part of the plan. Now we will sit on the chair and the chair will seem to spin on its own. He will simply be scared. Oh God, what's going on here? Is it possible that someone has settled in my secret bunker? Is it really a ghost? I'm so afraid of them. Now I urgently need to run away from here. Lord, someone let me out. I ran to my friend. I don't read his operating friend. Now I'll drink some milk. I'll show up and tell him everything. Hey, JJ, open the door. I need your help urgently. Please help me. <laughs> well, Mikey, hello. I've been following you all this time. What were you doing? Did you see everything I was doing? Lord, please forgive me. <laughs> okay, your apology is accepted. Just don't do this again, please. Otherwise, you and I will no longer be friends. <laughs>